Lion Fury's making a video? What? Now, what's up, guys? Uh, you know, Lion Fury here. Um, I just got back up from a nap. Uh, well, not really just back up from a nap, but I was like, I got done with my final end of course exam, and then I come home, and then I'm like, you know what? Five minutes power nap. I wake up to 9:30. The fuck? So, anyways, um. I slept through the whole entire, uh, um, like from like four to nine. Then I wake up, so I'm probably gonna have an all-nighter, which is not good because I have final exams. But I'm actually gonna do a bit of studying for my final exams, even though I mean, who really studies for final exams? I mean, come on, guys, it's high school. Um, <laughs> anyways, uh, so talking about my final exams and my end of course tests. Okay, um, here's how it's breaking broken down into my school. It's probably different for your schools if you don't live in the one of the southern states i'm not gonna say which um anyways so i have end of course testing which is eoct and there's three main core subjects science um math and lit and those are the three classes that i take eocts in now things like electives and other classes like history i take something called a final exam which a lot of you guys are familiar with and it's just an exam to you know finalize and see what you've learned in the class um that's just me putting out <laughs> random numbers so i'm going to tell you how my um eocts went and how my final exams are going to go so let's just get straight into it um only one of my eoct reviews i'm uh results have come back and that is my lit one and i thought i was gonna actually do the worst on that one but i got a perfect score which is a 100 out of um 100 so you know woohoo i i guess it's okay um but people in my school have been getting like everybody get like a 90 something so i mean i guess they curved it up super high but i don't think you can really curve a hundred unless yeah um anyways <clears throat> what I was talking about was the yeah so my EOC one second oops mom came in anyways uh, so my lit I actually thought I was gonna do pretty bad but you know but the test was actually pretty easy I got a perfect score and that should be facing me so that you guys can actually hear me <laughs> somewhat clear sorry about that if I just broke your ears um so my UCT scores for lit came in. I was pretty happy. I was like, teacher just called me over, made me squat on my knees, my knees, and she told me, and like, my lit teacher is. I mean, she's really really cool when she's really really nice, but like, I swear, like she kind of scares me sometimes. Uh, no, but anyways, on to my uh, math and my science exams. I just finished taking my science UCT today and yesterday yesterday and today you know two-day test um and I gotta admit it was really really easy I didn't find any discrepancies or anything really hard in it um I think I might have missed zero or one question uh, I'm not really sure but I think it was extremely easy hopefully I'll get a perfect score on that you know that looked good on my transcript and uh, yeah okay um and then my math EOCT I I actually What's called the funny story about my math one was that the very first day I smoked it because um it was really really easy and then the second day I was stuck doing all these USA test preps and all this other stuff and I went to bed really late and then to top it all off we had yearbook signing and so my thing wasn't at its normal time and then I was super tired because everybody was yearbook signing it was sweaty all that stuff I was like. Really, and then I have to take it my last class period, and then this retard in my class, he's seriously holding up everybody because we can't start until he opens up the test nap. So like he's like, and he tells the teacher blah 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 blah, um, and then he says some stupid crap, and then he won't open up. So I just get up out of my seat, I just walk over. Like the kid's like a super scrawny kid, and I'm like, I'm not buff, but like I I could knock him out one hit. Um, like, you know, like, DDS spec IRL, but, like, with my fist. Um, anyways, <clears throat> I, I could have, like, beat the crap out of him. And he was super annoying. His name's Dylan. Um, so I was just like, you know what? And I looked down at his paper, typed in his info, 
open I'm mean, open it up typed in his info and then just sat down so we could start and like everybody in the class just kind of like stared at me for a minute and like the teacher like face palmed and then we started test and I was like super pissed off already then and but you know I think I did pretty well uh, I was super tired so you know it kind of sucks whatever but I mean uh yeah it was probably <laughs> not the best thing for me <laughs> to just go up and like I guess you could say just type in his info but he was really getting on my nerves and wasn't really good for me uh, I was at the point where I was like if you're not gonna do it I'll punch you in the face oh uh, <clears throat> but anyways now my final exams because these are for my elective classes so I have my Spanish exam and my uh, my health exam today because you're gonna be watching this on Friday but it's really tomorrow for me Inception. <laughs> um, so I'll have my Spanish exam and my health exam today, tomorrow. But you know, today for you guys. Then Monday I'll have my. I think this is my biology exam. <laughs> Hundred, no problem. My lit exam is just gonna be over Romeo and Juliet. No problem, no problem. The only exam I'm really gonna have problems with is my third period exam, and I mean, this is gonna really hurt. I mean, I have to sit in the freaking lunchroom for an hour doing absolutely nothing I can do nothing <laughs> I can't read a book I can do nothing it's an exam and, and I'm seriously sitting there like are you joking me so I mean that, that I'm just gonna be daydreaming about RuneScape I'm like mm, dude I could DDS spec some kid IRL but you know I mean that, that you know doesn't happen so you know <laughs> um yeah it kind of sucks uh and yeah so I think it's actually pretty cool that um our teachers are actually really cool with our finals they're not doing anything hard or anything um and well, I swear my mom just keeps on coming into my bathroom and like messing with something and she just walks out and I'm like the fuck because I have this thing called the Jack and Jill bathroom Oh my gosh, one sec. Anyways, back on subject. Oh, cool thing to talk about. My birthday. <laughs> oh, my birthday was May 15th. Um, Turned 15. 15 on 15th. Pretty cool. <laughs> um, Yeah, I turned 15. So, it was like, uh, no party, no anything. I mean, I really could care less if I had a party or anything. Um, Kind of overrated didn't want to spend money on even like a movie theater or anything because i mean i don't really do anything on my birthday well i mean i usually do it's just like nah no point and like and i, I know i'm gonna get that viewer that's like oh i have like a million dollar celebrity come over my house and uh yeah um my parents did spend like <laughs> a bunch on like a cake it was pretty cool because it was like chocolate covered strawberries decorated around a cake and I had my name on it and then I had 15 in um, Spanish quince and um so it's pretty cool like not that I'm Spanish but you know I don't, I don't know maybe that a Spanish freaking person in Kroger I, I don't know um but yeah so, so it was in Spanish I was like mm, cool uh, maybe because I mean, this isn't really much of an achievement, but like, I scored bronze on the national Spanish exam. It's like, whatever. Um, uh, it cost me a lot of money to actually uh, enter it, but you know, I wanted like a $30 check, so you know, whatever. Um, it was pretty cool. IRL merchant right there. Um, and I'm finally getting down to my last thing, but man, what's it called? This year has been a crazy year, I gotta admit, um, it was probably one of the best years besides 7th grade that I've had, um, you know, a lot of people do change in high school, but you know, a lot of people do say the same, you meet, you know, you actually do meet a lot of new friends, um, last year I, I hung out with the, uh, I guess you could call the trolley group, like, not trolley group, but like, if you guys know what bronies are, then you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. But it's the group of people that really troll and like, <laughs> I've got to admit, they, they are uh, hated a bit, so you know, it's called. And then this year, you know, I'm actually like hanging out with uh, 
the more popular kids it's, it's pretty cool um yeah but not like super popular or anything like that i'm not like preppy or anything because i mean i actually do hang out with the preppy kids not really hang out but like i talk to them um a few people they actually used to play rs uh, i told you about them they uh they kind of quit though because you know they're noobs but yeah <laughs> Um, they did come back for a month, but then they were like, Oh, RuneScape membership too expensive, must go play World of Warcraft. And I'm like, World of Warcraft costs more. But the graphics are so much better. And, <laughs> and I was just sitting there like, okay, you know what, just wait till RS3 comes out. Um, but anyways, because <laughs> I know a lot of you, your EOC viewers are like, Oh, RuneScape, best game. Because <laughs> I mean, it's pretty good. Oh! And I want to talk to you guys about some stuff really quick. Let me bank this on. Boom. Counter-Strike Source. Arctic Combat. Team Fortress 2. Steam sales are beast. I've got to admit, Steam sales are the coolest thing in the world. Um, Steam Summer Sales. I'm going to be getting so many games for my gaming channel that I'm going to be setting up. It's going to be absolutely amazing. I'm going to love Steam Sales. Um, but I'm still going to be playing a lot of RS and it's going to be hard to manage PS. I have to um my Spanish teacher since like I guess I'm half decent at Spanish, you know. I'm not going to say I'm like a super pro, but you know, I'm I'm like I'm like decent, you know. Um wants me to do this cool like Spanish project uh, over the summer about myself and like collage in Spanish so I was like you know what why not so like yeah so I'm just doing it. it's pretty cool I guess you could say uh, so yeah that's only gonna take like a day or two so I shouldn't really be worried about that but I have a lot of stuff to balance in um because I have to make enough time to you know play RuneScape you know with all those other games make walkthroughs uh go to the gym and uh hang out with friends so it's gonna be like my time's gonna be cut so much on top of the fact that i have to actually register my um i have to get my permit too uh because i'm 15 now but i have to register my cousin yeah that's right i have to register my cousin for uh her final exam not really her final exam um i guess you could say uh I have to register her for my um for her to uh why would I say final exam <laughs> I'm super tired guys sorry about that um I'm actually helping her uh register into my school because um the, I guess I could tell you uh I think I told box rs um I don't really remember but I told him that my cousin was coming through I didn't tell him the reason oh, okay so base well yeah I did he might have forgotten though one sec Okay, I'm back. Just had to fart. Didn't want to record that. Um, kind of weird. <laughs> okay, so my cousin is actually coming to uh, to my state because. Okay, so her parents want her to go to China and live in China and do her schoolwork in China, and that's not gonna get you. I mean, China's like a really good place, but I mean, you're competing against so many people to get into university for free. It's just not gonna happen. So what she wants to do is um is come to america you know learn her stuff because she's in america right now she's living with uh her parents friends family yeah her parents friends family yeah okay that makes that makes sense so she's um she's living with her uh her parents friends family okay let's just say her her um friends family no no the fam oh she's living with a different family that has that's friends with her mom okay anyways so since the two are single and they don't really like kids uh they kind of um took her in only for a year and then she now has the choice to either go to china or blah 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 or live with us and i'm just sitting there like are you serious <laughs> like i mean i personally don't care because she's not sleeping in my room because one not a pedo two not a pedo three not a pedo <laughs> anyways um yeah she's not gonna be sleeping in my room they're gonna get a uh, uh what they're gonna do is they're gonna get an extra bed and just plop it into my parents room so yeah or you know my my parents will just make me sleep on the couch and then she'll just get my bed which you know will kind of suck because i won't be able to play rs 
get a Nexus 7 tablet, play RS at night. <laughs> no, but, um, I mean, I personally don't care. It's just, uh, I have to fill out a bunch of paperwork and then I have to go to a couple appointments, um, throughout the summer because the, uh, schools actually open a couple days throughout the summer. So, you know, mm, got stuff to do. Um, and then the last couple days, I'm going to have to talk to the administrators at my school after I'm done with my final exams to finalize things, this and that, and, you know, just really get her incorporated into my school. So I've got a very, very busy, um, very, very busy, uh, I guess you could say schedule throughout the summer. So, you know, if you don't see that many RuneScape videos um, from me and you want to hear some commentary from some other games... I'm going to have a, a new gaming channel. I don't know what to call it. I'm probably going to call it the Lined Fury in nature <laughs> or something stupid like that. Um, Just to really, uh, um, I have no idea. I'm like brain dead. Uh, but I thank you guys for watching this very, very long video. Um, It's just short of um to tell you all about um what's been happening in my life and all that stuff. So I hope you guys take the time to hit that like button. Um. For everybody that actually made it to the end of this video, um, congrats to you. Uh, what should I say to um? Okay, say if you watch till the end of the video, say security guard. The security guard is a faggot, and if we get over ten people that have say, said that, you know, I'll do a, a ten mil UC giveaway. Just because I mean if you watch the end of this video even if it's only 10 people that just shows that you know a decent amount of people care so I'll just um just uh I guess just record a small clip of me actually giving away 10 mil on EOC so I hope you guys I thank you guys for watching I probably won't see you guys um for a couple days um you guys will see me but I'm gonna be going to China pretty soon so no new videos I already have a bunch of pre-recorded videos so uh, I thank you guys for watching. Um, remember to have fun with your life and all that stuff. Um, I, I sound like a counselor. Um, you guys might not see me ever again, you know, in case I die. I mean, not like saying that I'm likely to die. I'm just saying, no possibility. Um, so I guess I'll see you guys soon. This is Lion Fury signing off.